Hey viewers, welcome to another game of Schedule Pro Gamer. Today we are doing another Jace game. So Jace has been out for a couple of days now and I decided to do another game with him. This is, I guess, the third one on my channel. It's all good, I don't really care. This one was sent to me uh, straight in the beginning, but yeah, I always get from uh, strong champions, I always get a lot of games. So don't worry if yours is not in there. Uh, it either is going to come or you will have to send me another game in time. Uh, if it's your first game, so if you've never been on my channel, please put like first in uh, or first time in the title somewhere. Or yeah, one ST is good enough. Um, yeah, I will notice that and that way I have kind of an an idea of who to pick because uh, I get a lot of games from my regular, well, people that give me games. And I try to mix in as many of the first time, uh, f well, first time sub uh, submitters as I can. But I don't always recognize your names. I mean, I have, yeah, so many people sending me games, and lots of them already have a game on my channel. But if you want a game on my channel and it's your first time, just put it in there. It's uh, the easiest way to do it, and um, it seems that. Um, we uh, fast forward it for about a minute 20. I don't know how this happens all the time, but anyhow, uh, we did see some uh, harass going down, and I think Jace should go back here. He did uh, use up one of his uh, potions there. And yeah, it did seem that um, there was indeed. Uh, really long loading screen that's why I fast forwarded and that's also why I uh, I skipped forward like a minute 20 because I forgot to hit the 2 button so anyhow it seems that uh, he's all alone here in bottom lane because Jax who um, was indeed playing on his toaster um, yeah he is uh, still at the summoner platform so I don't know who just got that. Was that top lane? No, I don't know. I don't know. So, oh, getting a one for one trade, which is not really what he wanted, of course. Yeah, whatever. It is. Uh, it's not the best of starts, of course. You uh, you don't want to give away a kill early on. And wow, teleport on Melzahar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, well, already noticed the promote, but that guy is just uh, AFKing like a boss, or disconnecting like a boss, whatever, um, so it doesn't really matter <laughs> what he has, and anyway, we, uh, we just picked up the dagger for extra attack speed, so we are going into uh, AD mode, and of course, yeah, with... Uh, the, uh, the, 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 come on, what are the, the orange numbers here? <sighs> the physical damage ratios on two of your skills, you want to go for that, uh, da uh, yeah, damage instead of attack speed. But, yeah, he doesn't, he didn't really have a choice. I mean, this is 420, and you can easily invest that early game, but, um, he only had, like, 500. So for 500 you cannot really buy anything good that uh, that you would need for later on uh, in the attack damage. Oh, don't overextend. You're up against two. <laughs> Man, if you're one against two, you need to not overextend at all. So yeah, that's the way it works. And um Wow, it's three versus three still. It's it's not too bad. So this guy guy finally decided to uh to actually pick up his mouse and uh do something. And yeah, the the do something is in his case just stand around in the bush doing nothing. Which is of course excellent. That is the way you want that. You um you, you want to be in a bush and not gaining levels, because that is the strongest tactic in this game. 
And, um... Oh, come on! Yes, nicely done. Even without vision, who needs vision, man? Who needs vision if you have a new champion? And double kill, nicely done. Without any assist from Jax, because Jax just, uh, well, just was, was standing there. Just thought, oh, nice picture. Let me watch the fight. Oh, did you hit him? Oh, doesn't that hurt? Anyhow, <laughs> finally he is coming in. He is already level 2 now. Because, well, yeah. The later in the game it gets, the faster you level up, so. It seems that um, uh, our, our Jace here has had enough. And I don't know why, because he could have just uh, did a lot more damage. And, oh, Jax, 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 how about actually doing something? Like running away. And now he's standing over here and doing nothing. It really doesn't matter to him what, well, where he's doing it, as long as he can do nothing. Oh, he's not even going to steal this? Oh, that's good. No, I think he disconnected again. Yeah, there we go. Still very fortunate he was in that bush, because otherwise he would have definitely been killed. Anyhow, uh, <laughs> it's kind of nice that they don't uh, recall anymore. They just walk home now. Because now at least they get home, uh, instead of uh, getting killed first. And yeah, it's kind of uh, strange that this guy already recalled, well he killed some more minions. And he recalled, and now he's already halfway there before this guy <laughs> actually arrived. <laughs> but it is a lot safer, so I do have to agree with that. So the seal has been um, uh, has been completed. But as I said, the uh, the skills don't get a boost from that. Uh, well, from that zeal, from that attack speed. And he does have the attack speed boots as well, so his attack speed is pretty good now. And come on! Yes, nicely done! And he is going to get the hell out of here. Come on, jump! Yes! Oh! Yeah, that's not him! And yeah, this this guy is pretty low as well. So one Q and uh, he will shoot him in the face with enough damage, I think. But yeah, he will have to switch to the cannon, of course. Um, why would you? Oh, come on! There we go. Why would you? do this in your own bush you know there's nobody there yeah another free kill so that's excellent that's the way we want it and fortunately the rest of the team all of a sudden decided well we're not going to lose to these bunch of noobs let's just, just let's just kill them all and um, indeed everyone is positive now well Jace is the positivist but that's because he's in a one versus two lane and finally decided well, yeah, let's just kill them. Let's not get killed. Let's just let's just kill them. Yeah, starting off at zero and two, kind of puts a dent in your morale. And um, yeah, he did very well after that. Oh, another guy with teleport. That is excellent. Because uh, yeah, having teleport on your side laners is of course really important if you have a two versus one lane or two versus two lane. It is. Uh, yeah, it is not useless at all to teleport in the middle of the lane with a squishy champion. No, no, no. You, you, it's very useful for the enemies because then they get free kills. And that is exactly what this game is all about. Free kills. So yeah, we have teleport, teleports, and then uh, decent summoners. She still needs flash in my opinion. But uh, even, well, the, the heal is good, so... Uh, I would prefer heal flash, but yeah, heal is at least good. Ash with heal flash, that's good. And then um, uh, flash ignite on Darius, that's fine, of course. 
Uh, <laughs> uh, did he teleport into? Because he was all he all of a sudden was here. But I think he just teleported as well. And um, yeah, that's of course what you do. You teleport into the. You teleport into the the middle of the minions, right on top of an enemy champion with your squishy champion. And of course, a fat champion is the best for that. So if you have a Jace that is uh, eight and two or seven and two, then um, you want to squish uh, to, to your squishy champion to land right on top of him, uh, even if you're a ranged champion. So you, that's that's just the way you want it. Oh, he didn't teleport in because he now teleported in. So he must have ran in and came in from the side or something like that because he definitely didn't come from the turret or he wouldn't get have been killed like that. Seems that um, the mid laner is uh, pushing up quite heavily, but our side laner here is holding his lane, and uh, as long as he can get farmed, and it's all good. He of course doesn't have a lot of minions. He only has 18 now. And wow, this this Olaf man, he was complaining about not being able to carry, but yeah, he seriously can't carry. But the 19 minions is actually not that bad. I mean, 24 here and 32 here, but for the rest, he's doing pretty well. Oh, hang on, 54. Uh, didn't see that. And is he going to make it out? Yes, he's going to make it out. No problem. So Riven finally saying, yeah, th th it's, it's gone on long enough. Let's just kill you. So the Olaf is now complaining with his 2 and 3 score and 8 minions. He's complaining about um, uh, our team is full of idiots. When he is in fact the only one, well no, not the only one. Warwick is also negative, but... Is one of the two negatives. I don't know why she didn't just walk around that or jumped over it. But anyway. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's kill her, kill her, kill her. No, <laughs> he's not going to be able to do that. But some nice uh, combinations here, uh, variations between the hammer and the cannon. I don't know if it's called a hammer. Yeah, it's called... Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, not really hammer. So, um, yeah, just another kill for the vein, uh, Riven there. And the Riven... Uh, Jace combination should actually be uh, very strong. This mid lane is um, is kind of being pushed all the time, and they need to take care of that. No defense, the base man. Defense, the base. Not defend, no defense. Just put a, a, a monkey, uh, a super monkey here or something like that. I mean, it's not that hard. I know that's very random for those of you not following uh, Bloons Tower Defense or not playing Bloons Tower Defense. But yeah, that's uh, tower defense, man. That's how you defend a tower. Come on, get him! Oh man. <laughs> oh, she's so low and she's going to stay in. Come on. No, no, you're low as well. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> this is so risky. <laughs> oh, she was in that bush. He would have been so dead. Come on, shoot her. Oh, he didn't shoot her. Come on. You always shoot her. Oh no 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 run out run out What are you doing? Shut down. 
Oh, that's so sad. Anyhow, we're going mid lane. We're going to watch how this uh, Riven kills everyone. <laughs> Come on, Riven, kill the noob. Kill the noob. A has oh, noob lord reconnects. Maybe he can stand in the bush now. This bush would be, it would be nice for that. This one. Or maybe this one, that's further away from the minion, so that you make sure that you don't get any uh, any experience. Or, and that would be my preferred choice, this one over here. Because that way you're not near the fighting, you, you have nowhere to, you, you're nowhere near the fight, and you, uh, you don't get any experience. I mean, that is uh, super important. Oh no, he didn't actually dis uh, reconnect. Oh, it's three. Uh, <laughs> well, it was four guys, but three guys at the base. That is excellent. That's exactly what you want to have. Come on, kill them all! Kill them all! He actually saves the turret here, but is he going to die? No, he's going to be fine. Now he's not. Yeah. Oh no, Riven! Uh, Riven using her ultimate on an enemy that she was never going to get, and not u only using the uh, the ranged AOE effect. <sighs> so we have three guys now AFKing. Oh no, this guy just died. Hang on. Wow, he has so many items already. <laughs> oh no, are we going for more attack speed? Really? We're going full attack speed? Oh, come on, man. At least do something with attack damage. <laughs> the slow going down. With nobody to follow up. Riven comes in. And what does Riven have? Riven has some nice damage and actually has a lot of damage. And come on, they need to kill this Darius. Darius needs to die. No. No, Riven, where are you going? Well, Riven was pretty low, so I can see how that works. No, Riven was uh, very low. That was she, what she was. And yeah, they need to uh, to stay back a little bit more. And Olaf still complaining about his team. Well, he is the one that's making all of the big plays. Because uh, the big plays are, of course, running into your enemy and dying. Six times in a row. Oh, actually, seven. seven no, no, no. Uh, he only did it four times, so it's not too bad. It's uh, Warwick, he's one and seven. And Warwick is of course getting the blue buff, because getting the blue buff on AD Warwick is probably the most important thing you can do. The red buff is for losers. Man, couldn't they just avoid the traps? No, the, the red buff uh, with like a slow and things like that, no that's for losers. What you want as AD Warwick is just to grab that blue buff and uh, just stand around in places. So walk next to your minions or stand around in the middle of the lane. Like, yeah. Not not near the fighting or anything like that. No, just on the other side of the map. And so Jax probably disconnected again. Oh, no, no, no. He's still there. And he is going for that, uh, what's it called? The, the sheen. And flashing out here when that really wasn't necessary. And now he has to make it all the way back. Yeah, but he is going to grab a kill. Yeah, that flash really wasn't necessary. Uh, dude, just one tip. Don't discuss things with, with these noob lords. I mean, just let the Warwick and the... the Jax and uh, Olaf do whatever they want. Just talk to Riven. Just uh, put them to ignore over here. And just talk to Riven. J just coordinate things with Riven and make sure that you can get the kills and uh, the towers that way. I mean, 
That's the only way to win here. And Riven needs to get the hell out of there. No. Dude, tower shots. And somebody needs to help. How about you, Jax? How about you actually do some damage here? Ja Jace, Jace, Jace. Dude, help her out. Yeah, of course, Warwick decides to jump in and just get killed. Because um, him getting killed doesn't really matter. And Riven is a lot better at uh, at this game, so he decides to trade that. So come on Jace, do some damage here, do some damage. Wow, it's it's so frustrating that if you're doing so well in a game that you can't carry because um, people are just too stupid to be carried. But that's just the way it is at this moment. And there we go, getting another kill. But yeah, the, um, the Riven is still playing very well. It's just that the other three are... Well, either AFK or uh, disconnected or just plain stupid. Like in this Warwick's case. Warwick, can't really, you can't really say that um, he has been AFK or uh, disconnected. He just engages in the wrong situations. He did save Riven there and that was worth a whole lot for Riven. Because Riven currently is on a major killing spree. And would have given out a whole, yeah, here, eight kills in a row. And she would have given uh, 600 gold or something to uh, to the enemies. And that is definitely not what you want. So Jack's only level six. He needs to go jungle or do something to get uh, experience. But not hang around on the, in the group and just do nothing. But he doesn't seem to understand that concept. So Riven grabbing another kill here. And yeah, Warwick is just there to uh, distract the enemies, and that's exactly what he's doing. Another kill, come on! No, don't die! Oh, that is such a shame. But yeah, they do pick up the kill, so that's all good. And all in all, that was a 1-4-3. Yeah, so that's good. The problem is, of course, that there are two more champions running around somewhere. And this Caitlyn is, uh, is one of them. And yeah, you can't really get all of the lanes under control. You just need to... Oh, they should have just taken this turret. 400 hit points. Should have just taken the turret. I think it's still going to die to these minions. But unless they switch target. No, 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 no. So let's go over here and watch this. Come on, she can't escape. And Warwick, don't use your ultimate, even if you get it. There we go. Oh, someone's here. I think it's... Uh, I don't know who it is. I wanted to say Jax. Oh, it's Darius, I think. No, it's this guy. Who um, decides to just come in and get killed. So he kind of has um, the Warwick brain on him. And um, yeah, deciding that it's better to just... Uh, oh, they didn't switch targets. Yes, they did switch targets. So it's good for Warwick. That's the way it's supposed to work. And Warwick didn't get another kill, right? No, no, no. That was a good play on him. He... Um, oh man, they lost another turret. Anyhow, the... <laughs> The Warwick just died to save Jace, and that was good, because Warwick is worth about 50, 50 gold, something like that. And um, Jace is worth about four or five hundred, so... And yeah, another kill there on the Jax. I don't think he died that many times, just very under level. No, he is, it's his first death. But he is only level 7, so 3 versus 5, they're not going to win this anytime soon. 
they may actually be able to win this, but it's going to take a long, long time, and the enemy probably will have to surrender and not actually uh, lose, because in the end game there's no way they can win. So if this game goes on for too long, even the bad farmers on the enemy team will have plenty of money to uh, to get whatever. But yeah, who knows, maybe they get a few aces in a row and uh, they can actually kill some turrets. But that's the problem most of the time. <laughs> oh man, this was not a good death on, uh, on Warwick. <laughs> Warwick signals to be careful. Don't know where that was or when that was, but it's just funny that he is the one overextending all the freaking time and then he decides to tell people that they need to be careful. Unfortunately, another kill there by... Um, yeah, by, by the Darius, but yeah. That is just going to be very hard to handle. And yeah, level 14 versus level, what is he, 8? Something like that. I think he's 8. That is not going to work out really nicely. And Warwick just decides to stand here and do nothing. Oh, yeah, because the ultimate is going to do a whole lot. Dude, at least wait until your enemies are, or your allies are there. No, no, no. Finally he gets a kill. Didn't expect the the jump to do that much damage, but he has the seal? No, he has nothing. So I don't know where that damage came from. No, we don't want to surrender. Anywho. Yeah, we, uh, we got an enemy, of course. I was just wondering what happened to this guy. Who are you? Jax? Yeah. Oh man, Jax. Jax, get out! Get out! Get out! <laughs> Told you. <laughs> he was going to die. <laughs> Who uh, started the surrender vote? It is Warwick. Yeah, if you're 1 in 12. And you don't recognize when you need to make a play and when you shouldn't make a play. Just like this Jax, by the way. Who um, now falls in both categories. Not only is he... Um, uh, a, well, AFK. No, no, no. Warwick. Yeah, no, Jax was, uh, was AFK slash disconnected. But not only in that category, also not uh, understanding uh, when he needs to engage. So... No, no, you're going to get killed. Oh, that was very well played on uh, on Vayne's part. But Vayne needs to back off. Yep. <laughs> oh, man. It's so easy to see when people are going to get killed. Yeah, that's not going to do a whole lot, is it? Triple kill for, uh, for Riven. And they finally get to do something here. Because they finally have... Oh, no. I... I wanted to say they finally have nobody in the lane, but then, of course, Darius shows up, and Darius is ridiculously strong, especially when he uh, pops that uh, that that shield at Radwin's Omen. <sighs> so another 600 golds. No, really, Darius must die. I thought Romeo must die, but must have been wrong there. Anyhow, we are going to go back in and we're going to kill all of these minions. <laughs> it's two uh, Phantom Dancers finally has something in the form of uh, da actual damage. But uh, it's not nearly enough to kill Darius. <laughs> it's not even close to it. And he has one stack on the blood Cersei. Excellent. Ah uh, yeah, these other two are just jungling still, and uh, of course, yeah, the, the ultimate from uh, Warwick is coming out, because that's the only thing he knows how to do. If I just hit R and then click on someone, then um, I will actually win the game. That's what Mobifire said. And, dude, run out already. 
man. Yeah, now he has to flash and almost runs back. But yeah, he wanted to get that kill, I guess. But that really doesn't matter at this point. He does. It shouldn't get any kills. And yes, Darius is probably the most OP champion of all time. Because not only is he very noob friendly, you can actually get a lot of uh, things done with him, even well when your uh, when your opponents are very good. So here, someone like uh, Trindamir, yeah, it's a lot harder to pull off in the high elo, and therefore it's not it's it's more of a noob friendly champion, rather a noob killer, pop stomper. And um, yeah, in in uh, the case of Darius, it's both. It's uh, it's both a very high elo uh, monster, and it is a low level, well, crusher. But yeah, you have to deal with him with a ranged champion early game. If you have a ranged champion against him, he ca he can't farm, and if he can't farm, then he's not very good. But of course, yeah, at this point, he doesn't really care anymore. He has so much. Uh, he has so much items that yeah, it doesn't really matter what you do against him. I mean, uh, Redder's Omen and uh, Frozen Mallet are going to, and uh, of course the Mercury Strats, going to make sure that he can get in close, uh, even if you try to hit him from a range. But yeah, with the two of them, they should be able to kill this. Come on, come on, come! Oh, missing all of the skill shots, but they do get the kill there, and. Yeah, they do get a double kill. Nicely done. He is going to heal because um, yeah, he was getting pretty low. And of course, yeah, now they need to make something happen before this guy respawns. Because otherwise you're in the same, well, situation once again. And you did all that work for virtually nothing. So Riven is uh, building up so much gold that she uh, almost has her full items and course that's when the trouble starts you can actually or you would actually be able to win uh, uh, 3 versus 5 or no 4 versus 5 I guess 3 versus 5 are very hard to win but uh, you can actually win a 4 versus 5 if you had the ability to get more items but at some point you will have the maximum number of items and you will not be able to do anything anymore and your your opponents are just going to buy more and more items over time while all you can do is buy some elixirs and just store up your gold and that is of course very annoying to have and that's why you can't win uh, 4 versus 5 well the gold difference of course but since this is not in, um, in spectator mode I can't really see what the gold difference is um, but I'm pretty sure that the enemies are still ahead, even though there are 13 kills, 12 kills behind. Um, they are severely ahead in golds, and at least that's what it normally is. But I guess in this case, because Warwick is the one that died like 12 times now. Okay, 14 times now. I don't really think that... Um, and he is going for that Matters Blood Razor. Um... I don't think that he's, uh, or well, th that the gold on the opponent's kills is really uh, a whole lot, because they they lose like five, six kills because of that Warwick dying twelve times or fourteen times in a row. And yeah, it's the it's the legendary or uh, the the legend commentary is built, of course, the uh, blood razor first because yeah, mobile fire says it's good and it must be good. Come on, Riven! No! Yeah, of course she was going to die. Um, <laughs> so, where are we at? Yeah, so he only has that Matters Blood Razor, which is not going to do anything. It doesn't add anything to anything else, and at least he will probably have uh, magic penetration, so that makes the Blood, Searcher, uh, the blood Razor sorry, a whole lot better. No, well, it's not an easy win, but they can still win. But 21-2 and 17-9. to 9. 
they should be able to do pretty well. 18 to 9. And really, the, the deaths don't really matter anymore. It's all about the kills. And uh, wow, three Phantom Dancers. Dude, get some damage already. And get a Guardian Angel. Because this is getting pretty annoying. You can't win by just building attack speed. That doesn't work. No! Yeah, Riven has to defend all alone, and without Riven they shouldn't have uh, gone up there anyway. Because Riven, yeah, she is the one that uh, that probably has the most gold. <laughs> oh man, this guy coming in to get a free, uh, to give another free kill there. No, Riven, pick up these minions. They need to defend the base. Warwick is over here defending the base, but uh, yeah. So one lever over there, and I don't know where Jax is even. Oh, he's here. He's just—he uh, was just dead, I guess. Um, level twelve, Jax. So level eight, Olaf. Yeah, of course. Level thirteen, Jax, and. Um, yeah, the rest is level 18. Oh no, Warwick is also level 16. Uh, at least the minions are starting to add up. Um, yeah, Riven, definitely the highest minions on this team. Uh, only Caitlyn has more, but yeah, she has way more gold than, uh, than that Caitlyn. But Caitlyn has been farming all game. And she has been pushing top lane most of the time. And oh no 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 he's going to get killed here Run <laughs> Oh man It's gonna be close No he's no 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 They're in the bush Oh man he got so lucky there they're coming for Riven now I thought we we disconnected but Riven might have. Oh man. Yep, there goes Riven. And of course this guy is going to uh, is going to chase her because it's the only way he can get a kill. So a disconnect for Riven and that is uh, putting a serious dent in their defense. Because now all they have is Jace. And of course, use this Warwick. There we go. Warwick fortunately not getting that kill. That would have been very bad if he got that kill. But yeah, they are going to grab this kill. Come on. There we go. He does have a pretty nice uh, attack speed there. But <laughs> and a what a 100% critical strike yeah so um, yeah they have to defend their turrets here because their turrets are going to fall man especially that left one but yeah the uh, attack speed coming in very useful here because he has to attack multiple minions and of course you, you don't really use your skills oh he, yeah he went for the wrong minions told you the left turret was under attack the right turret could have held off much longer and they do regenerate nexus turrets do regenerate so it's really not a problem and they need to stay in the base now enemy team is probably going for Baron there's really nothing they can do about that they have to stay in the base and um, well at least he has 40 stacks now uh, they have to defend their base a lot better because, um, yeah, now that they lost one turret, the other turret can get sniped pretty easily by just one or two opponents. And this guy is dead. Or at least should be dead. Come on. Come on. Oh, very nice ultimate. Very not just useless ultimate. There's 1500 health left. But yeah, it was really close. And there you go, here, as I said, one opponent will take out this turret, and she could have actually taken out this turret. 
And a very good ultimate there from Melzahar. He, uh, he says it's for noobs when you, they put the null zone down first. Because, um, yeah, you don't want to actually grab kills on... Uh, uh, you don't actually want to grab kills with your ultimate because that is for yeah that's for serious noob uh, newbiness and you want to be pro and just well don't do that. So we're uh, going for the infinity edge. So he has about 150 percent uh, critical strike here, which makes part of the item kind of useless. It does provide you with 50 percent extra damage on every attack, so that's pretty cool. And yeah, since every uh, hit now uh, now uh, is a critical strike <laughs> this is pretty decent <laughs> oh sorry yeah I was following around uh, I thought he was still in base but they actually uh, get the the Darius so and yeah his strikes only do like 700 damage that is not a whole lot that is not what well we would want Of course his attack speed is ridiculous, 2.2 .2. And oh yes, they do lose their last main uh, turret here and um, Yeah, this means that um, the enemies can now start to uh, just run in and kill the Nexus And that's because they haven't been defending properly They've been going forward too often and lost all of their inhibitors because of that Well, multiple times they uh, they need to just defend the bases, not care about the opponents, and then uh, when the inhibitors come back up, they can uh, they can care about the opponents again. Of course, free kills like this, yeah, you don't leave them, but uh. <laughs> uh, yeah, with this attack speed now, it is uh, it is okay to. Uh, to just go in and kill someone as squishy as that. But yeah, he doesn't have any defense. He has uh, way too much attack speed. <laughs> I just don't uh, don't think that's a good combination. And who was that? Hang on. Is that a turret? Or is that one of the minions that actually killed him? I think he just did some damage to the turrets and thought, well, why not? I'm here anyway. Might as well. So yeah, it is um, defense time and uh, one of the inhibitors is going to come up in 30 seconds. And that's the one they need to defend. I don't know which one it is because I don't know in which order they uh, they fell it's the top one so at least they got that covered oh Riffen dies and once again that puts a huge dent in their defense but yeah it doesn't really matter this guy is just going to kill everyone Darius not really a problem anymore how can that be Darius has so much HP and tankiness. Did he not use the Red Runes Omen or did he uh, he use it for Riven of course? And yeah, nobody has the the defense needed. Oh Ash is uh, is gone as well. I noticed that before, but now I do notice it again. And they do lose their Nexus and that is a shame. So um it was kind of a 3 versus 4, but it was actually a 4 versus 4, but yeah, because of that war, we could, we could call it a 3 versus 4. And um, yeah, very nicely played, I have to say. It's just a shame that uh, you have these kind of, <laughs> of teammates. It's, oh man, it's so messed up that you play this well and then you still lose. Anyway, hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. GG.